Hello my friends, welcome to my channel. Uh, we didn't have with you for a while any video unboxing and I have some product in here to showcase for you so I will have to uh, hopefully I can create few videos for you today so I can pre-schedule just for in case some days get more difficult and I need to be prepared. So today we have, as you see the title, product from paint some way. And this is going to be a mixed video. We have in here two diamond painting, trick cross stitch canvases and some tools in here. Uh, now I will start as usual with diamond painting. So for those who don't like to watch cross stitch, you can just leave after that and watch some other YouTubers, right? But for those who like both of these crafts, more than welcome, stay till the end. Let's see what we have in here. So we're going to start with little canvas first as always. And thank you very much Paint Some Way for providing this product for you to review. Let's see what we have in here. Okay, the rose, uh, very interesting design because it's very kind of a dark uh, background, but what even more interesting that this is a uh, gems design, all gems only I see in here, black diamonds that is not gems, but obviously very high quality resin, so we will be open and see what is this. Uh, let me just straighten canvas a little bit and check at the same time the glue layer are very very thick in here it's almost like a mirror look and very very good quality uh, glue in this canvas and has only 10 colors I'm so glad that they create right now this full gems design more and more because they are truly fun to work on and yes, if you never tried diamond painting yet, my friends, you will love it. If you can just try one design first, you will definitely want to have some more. And I have been doing this for, what is it now, like over four years or something. And it still bring me joy to do that, which and last week I didn't diamond paint obviously but I did lots of cross stitch and I do have video on Thursday of diamond painting so if you missed that video please check it out and also you ask me to give you some life updates so that's a chit chat videos during the week and here it is beautiful rose with butterflies there's a two butterflies in here 30 by 40 centimeters and if I can show you uh, the symbols in here, they are very clear symbols. But because it's a neutral colors, maybe like in this light area, if I can show you light area, look how simple those look like. But I believe that's all one color in here. Just a minute. Six, six. Yeah, so all this light color, it's one color. So it will be easy just to place diamonds all one color on those light symbols i believe that's all one color i mean the symbol same thing and on a darker area it's more better visibility of course how about rose very very light colors and also about this particular canvas that uh, if you already probably pay attention very well you can see that the symbols is outlined in the circles and that's the kind that canvases that I don't really like to have I don't like the circles I wish they would be like just the symbols and that's it uh, but hopefully those gems good enough big enough to cover those um, circles and at the same time lots of you actually like a circles because they give you guide where to place gems uh, perfect and hopefully will work well now about this rose let me check the rose because this symbols not only see like if it's uh, the petals of the rose are so light they should put 
like a black ink in symbols instead they created in white it's visible but a little bit more difficult than background if I can show you very very close you see those light colors you can see them but I wish they would be like a darker same like as a background I don't know why they decided to create better color visibility for the picture instead of worry about visibility of the symbol better even rose would be darker color because of the symbols but it would be easier to place diamonds but anyway let's see what else we have with this so toolkit in a ziplock bag i love those bags i always collect them uh, and diamonds let's see what kind of diamonds we have in here oh, i love gems they make my day brighter when I see gems, you know. It's fun to see something sparkle. All right, so we need 10 colors in here only. And what kind of background colors in here? Kind of like a gray. Yeah, like a gray. And what is this color? It's kind of hard to see. Yeah, another color of gray. So basically, yeah, this is... Um, it looks like a little bit like brown background, but all the colors that I see, they look like grayish kind of. One bag of those black resin diamonds, and for the rose we have some brighter colors. So let's see from this colors first, from number one, so it would be brighter color first. That is for our rose. You can see rose will be mixed with pinks red kind of more like a raspberry and a little bit oh that it's like a more like a raspberry so mostly kind of like a pinkish colors all of them even this one looks like a red but that not exactly red red so this rose will be not as this color is showing obviously will be much much brighter so that's interesting to see what is going to be on the end after you place diamonds. And then you have a big um, bag of 310, which I think it's going to be outline all this um, leaves. Let me check. Yeah, number four. So whatever you see in here, the darkest symbols, which are butterflies and the flower uh, stem in here. So that's going to be black. And then we have two bags of number five, which is kind of gray colors, if you can see. Gray to mossy greenish, kind of a little bit, I think. Uh, and then number six, we have also two bags. And this color, what color you see? Yeah, they all kind of gray color. And then number seven, eight, nine, ten. All this one bag. At, at this one is much lighter gray. Okay, let's find a focus. And then we have a bigger size of gray and bigger size of black. And... Was this one even more bigger? No, this one same like this one, but if I can show you them together, it's almost like, almost like same color, like it's very, hold on, not sure if you're going to see the difference, can you see the difference in the color, very similar, right, maybe this color a little bit lighter. So that's the colors for this design. Very interesting design because you will have this nice and juicy pop of color of the rose itself and everything else will be just blend in in a gray and black color. So interesting. Interesting would be to see how this diamond painting would look on the end because this is very kind of, I find, unique design. And now something in here that in double bag, so this is going to be one of those soft canvases with European symbols, I guess, because that's how they pack them. 
and yes thankfully it's not double-sided adhesive this is a pour on glue cannot remember oh there you go there you go the tiger the tiger now remember the tiger look at this gorgeous I do have this tiger in a small canvas full gems and I think already I talked to you about this tiger that I mistake uh, one time I show you uh, what was a owl owl and tiger I couldn't remember which one I did so this is a gorgeous tiger what kind of gems in here okay so in here we have this is the square yes of course all this kind of soft canvases uh, have the same packing the same good good uh, toolkit in here because we have in here different uh, kind of tools if you are new to my channel you did not see an unboxing of these canvases yeah uh, never mind this box is squished but it's still you can use it so we have in here is it says in here no, it doesn't say number, but I believe this is the 10 placer. Then we have 4 placer. Oh, sorry. 10 placer, 4 placer, 1 placer. And I like that they always have this grippy on a pen. And pen, of course, is glittery. That's the way I like them. And tweezers. better than sometimes um, sometimes they have a worse this this tweezers is not that bad yet but i prefer the black one stainless steel that is very very strong uh, now let's see we're going to see this diamonds in a minute but let's see a tiger so this is year of tiger so we will see probably more tigers on my channel through the a year I don't know I cannot remember if I order more tigers or not uh, from other stores so this one uh, definitely um, I ordered because I wanted to compare when I will work on this tiger I will go to my stash that I already finished and I will pull out this tiger that I have exactly same image those beautiful blue eyes and full in gem but that can was like a little I think 30 by 40 centimeters that one was so this one in square diamonds it will be interesting to see comparison and you decide for example which one you think looks better regular diamonds with bigger size or smaller size but full in gems Usually this kind of canvases, I keep them flat on my table in one of those uh, folders that I have, clear folders. I love those folders and by the way, um, soon on my channel you will see some, you will see some new product that I was really, really surprised to see. I'm not going to save right now till I receive and then I can tell you if it's good or not but it definitely is something that is making me excited to review for you so what do you think about this pretty face that's a beautiful size 40 by 50 centimeters it has 35 colors in here legends on both sides I see already the glue in here incredible and if you can look I just tiny like very lightly put my finger in a glue and it's already grabbed very very strong so uh, very often I have questions uh, how do I seal my diamond paint and diamonds after I complete and my answer always I do not seal with anything I just keep it as it is uh, because when I finish I keep them in a the box obviously and if I frame them, the, the, those diamonds, nothing will happen with them in a frame. Uh, lately, company doing a great job by printing them perfect. That so doesn't have those pushing each other diamonds. Um, they really perfected diamond painted canvases to uh, a good quality. So the diamonds fit very nice. 
sometimes even gap and are so very tiny that it's like it's just beautiful so i do like it the way they in here pre-pack already them into the ziplock bags which huge help and you don't have to worry about containers and after you finish diamond painting obviously you can reuse this bags for something else for example sometimes if i have and i do have a whole bunch of uh, bags leftovers from my diamond paintings i use them for um, flower seeds vegetable seeds if i want to plant something in the backyard of my uh, any buttons any even if you can give those ziplock bags to your husband for garage to keep a bolts and nuts you know screws and nails stuff like that so definitely a good good um uh, good that they started to pack this kind of canvases uh, i mean diamonds into the ziplock bags because we can reuse them instead of those plastic that we just toss in them to our earth now i will open like this to show you what kind of colors we have in here obviously look at this beautiful blues for tiger's eyes and a little bit in here on the bottom that we see colors of blues let me just put them kind of this blue colors together in here look at this big bag of black okay so that's a lots of shades of blue in here look at this and this is kind of like a gray okay I just want to be careful okay just just for in case I see a few bags that they are not exactly close properly and some diamonds trying to escape so I will fix them right now some plastic from the diamonds went into the, into the bag connector okay just fix them uh -huh. okay a few more few more just a minute because i don't like later to have on my table diamonds laying around okay looks like all the bags zipped not bad in here so we have a one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen nineteen twenty 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 30, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and we have 35. Okay, so all colors in here, uh, as far as I can tell you right now, the diamonds looks really nice. Even I'm looking right now on black diamonds, I think they are really good diamonds in here. Look at that. not sure how much you will see you know what half about because they already in a ziplock bag let me put some on the tray because i really interested in this diamonds because it looks like a good quality but sometimes you put them on a tray and then you see something that is not so great so i just want to put like just a few to check them let's see see kind of dark from right now to see but you know what um i don't i don't think i see any like the separators what, what do you think as much as i can show you close i think that diamonds black diamonds in here is really nice you see how that they, they well this I didn't put too much but the way they line it up in a line with separators where you wouldn't have this line straight like this so I think the diamonds in here is really nice even 310 because we all know the more crucial diamonds it's 310 they usually bad bad quality could be this one is great so I'm really actually happy about that okay so wonderful now my lovely friends uh, if you don't like cross stitch uh, you can I can say thank you for watching with me uh, if you like to support and still stick with me and watch my other unboxing then please continue uh, I will do 
to be honest, I to open diamond paintings and touch these diamonds. It really cheered me up, I have to say that, because I kind of miss diamond paintings in these days. So let me put this aside right behind in here. And we have now cross stitch. Uh, I already see that I have in 20 minutes when my camera stops, I will continue. So first what I want to show you, I have in here two uh, containers, two packages. And they, you can see that they are magnetic, okay? Because this is a magnet that I like to use for my cross stitch. Uh, on the website, I believe they call them refrigerator, like a fridge magnets. But they are excellent for cross stitch. Uh, and they have uh, in many different designs. So there are some designs of the magnets match designs of diamond painting, canvases or cross stitch. And I have to say, uh, I pick this design, let me show you, that you will probably recognize that once upon a time I did review of cross stitch of this design with the peacocks. There's a doves, birds in here. It's a very, very beautiful cross stitch. I can't remember if I have a diamond painting like this, but because of this magnet, it has, um, you can see the first magnet, it's kind of like, feels like it's sticky. Maybe the, the glue kind of come out where it's connecting top and the uh, base. I just have to wipe out with alcohol, a little bit like a rubbing alcohol to wipe it because it feels a little bit stickiness. So this magnet is, you can see it's flat mounted in, on the inside and then you have another magnet that will keep from the bottom of your canvas and when I will stitch this design it's a perfect combination to have a matching magnet and I really really love this design and those magnets are really nice. Um, I'm using right now not only this magnet but also sometimes I add more stronger magnet that way my scissors uh, stick to it stronger too but if you want to just secure uh, just a needle this is really nice this is really nice and they are truly beautiful this uh, resin top probably with the picture printed on the bottom and it's just like kind of plastic um, if you want this to be a decoration on your fridge obviously you can use just like this or together even with this it still will be stick probably you can see that it is oh, grabbing a pretty good actually on this side also holding uh, your scissors so it will hold the scissors but this one is heavy scissors uh, so also you can use them for your kids lockers because uh, lockers uh, metal it's cool so if your kids like to put some notes in the locker, something that they have to do tomorrow or next week, some kind of plan for school, uh, this magnet also would be beautiful for them to decorate their locker on the inside. Okay, and then I have uh, one more magnet in here. Uh, and now I think so far I have together with this one, or four or five magnets. No, I think I have two more that I'm using right now. Now this magnet, okay, sorry, my camera stopped already. Okay, this magnet that I have, and I actually like that they put in a bubble wrap because not only bubble wrap, but also in the bags. Uh, before I receive some magnets without box. So I, I do appreciate box because it does um, less damage you will have. But I don't think uh, anything could happen with this product while it's travel because it's a uh, kind of like not breakable product to be honest. But never know how it have it you know care by the um, males. Okay, so this one also have a residue stickiness on the edges. Uh, maybe uh, this one have few scratches. So I guess you do you can damage them but definitely was damaged not from shipping or oh, now i can see that i have a scratch in here as well see i did not did not know this before 
because it's a I guess a soft resin and maybe let me try to push with my finger maybe resin didn't cure hard enough I don't know uh, let me see like uh, pay attention on this corner I will try to flush it let's see if you can see uh, what I'm talking oh there you see this corner like right in here uh, mm -hmm. oh there a little scratch uh, I did not see that before and I see this uh, tiny tiny scratches uh, on this one I don't know if you can see that or not and feels like air bubble somewhere oh, on this side on this side right there but after all I do like them and here is a design I think this is like a, uh, stories um, I think I saw Hyatt like this uh, grass stitch in this kind of like a magical story castle stuff like that. So the dime, uh, uh, this um, magnets for cross stitch really good. Also what you can do, uh, you can use them not only for cross stitch or uh, refrigerator magnets, you can use them for diamond paintings as well. So when you peel your, your clear sheet and usually when you let go this clear sheet can flip back into the glue so when you put one magnet under and the other one on the top you can keep this clear sheet stay put so you can work on an area where you work so that's another good uh, use of this magnets and I am telling you I really really like them I have one of these magnets with sunflowers which is ukrainian symbols of flowers lots of people around the world know now about sunflowers and i many times told you in my videos that we have a plantations and plantations of sunflowers because we produce oils for around the world and a very very yummy treats so the sunflowers magnets that i have like this i keep with my sunflower crustage that i have is a match and same design so this one design are gorgeous like this one is my favorite from this too but uh this one also very very pretty and majestic looking there's hot area balloon the moon the castle gorgeous castle and towers so yes uh, if you looking for something like this to help you in cross stitch to hold your needles or for diamond painting to keep your sheet uh, put while you diamond painting they definitely do work uh, to help you uh, to hold this uh, piece of paper so it doesn't flip back because sometimes it's flip on our own side and can stick to the glue very hard okay my friends so this is something that i really like and i do recommend which the magnet's not as strongest but it does do work what you need to do okay now we have three canvases of cross stitch in here and i will start i think i will start with my absolute favorite in here because i want to see i want to see if anything special about this wait till you see picture and you will know what i'm talking about and there you go uh, we did a video review with you about angels of seasons and this is autumn um, i do have what i have spring uh noel was it two or three uh, i did uh, kind of even comparison with them and one of these angels was with special threads with beads and i wonder if any else uh, any of the season have something special about them so this one is uh, 14 count ada 36 by 52 centimeters and this is atom so let's see uh, again uh, all these angels of season they have a similarity in their clothes with those beautiful um, waves on their dress that I absolutely love it 
and the designs borders uh, the, there's a similarity between them and here is the angel her face is absolutely gorgeous in here I love those waves of her hair this a scarf or whatever she's holding in her hands which you would think autumn could be in, in the colors of kind of like a red orange uh, fallen leaves so the when this tree turned into the red colors uh, surprisingly this one more look like a spring or summer to me I don't know so let's see what's what's if you have anything special in here uh, we have in here in full stitch 36 colors we have in here oh lots of different stitches in here my friends we have one fourth of the stitch three fourth of the stitch French okay so then let, let, let me start over a uh, one fourth of the stitch we have in two colors three fourths of the stitch we have in four colors French knots in three colors and back stitch in three colors so I guess no beads in here unless let me check on the inside no this is just the pattern in here so yeah uh, no no beads for this one so only uh, Noel angel that I review uh, had uh, beads seed beads and also had a metallic thread so I don't know yet if we have a metallic thread in here or not let's check it out and by the way uh, don't be scared about all the stitches that I just told you one fourth and three fourths or French knots uh, I do have already French knot tutorial how to create proper way French knot I do have two tutorials how to do two different kind of backstitch to find those video tutorials on my channel and maybe one day I will create tutorials also in one fourth or three fourths of the stitch but there is an easy way you have them already right in here on the back of this envelope that you've received your cross stitch because all the stitches right in here on the bottom look at this in here one fourth three fourth all the stitches you need to learn it's right in here okay but if you want me to one day just to show you visually how to do them uh, we definitely we can okay so let me keep this angel right now maybe like this on the side so you still can see yeah and let's check if we have oh yes we do my friends yes we do we have the same colors of the metallic threads oh that's make me happy already and look at this this beautiful palette and a special uh templates in here that is a little bit different than we used to uh i like this because it doesn't have a knots in here only folded so it's very easy to pick up one strand and start working and here it is this is the metallic threads right in here same exactly color as the other angel so whatever you see uh, those yellow colors i think that's where this metallic will go so it's going to be uh, not exactly yellow color but i already give you idea that you can create yellow to make a gold by using some yellow uh, blend yellow color for the blend and the, here here it is this metallic thread that it looks amazing to me look at that as close i can show you looking good and okay maybe see they are stapled together so let me separate them a little bit and show you maybe through the paper okay this way maybe will be better we will hide the background so you can see lots of metallic in here so I did not start on the other uh, angel yet so I have to see what's the best way will be and how many threads we will need to use this metallic um, I don't think the whole the whole thing you have to use which would be of course beautiful but it will be probably too thick and 
I'm not sure if I would use blend or not. So that's still kind of I'm thinking, but for now, I'm just going to show you on this palette colors that we have to have in here. So there is some brown colors in here, which now look, well, this brown is actually probably for her hair. She has a brown hair. But other than that, that's only her hair that tell me that this is uh, autumn, fall time. Other than that, it looks really cheery and springy, I would say, green and yellow colors. And blue and yellow, <laughs> which is my colors for now, you know what I mean. Okay. So this is gorgeous. I'm really happy that we have something special in here and that is metallic threads and it's a lots of them in here. They are folded on half and look how many. A lot. And they, I think before was longer than the other threads. Now this time, uh, same link, but this is a long link. Feels like it's even longer than one meter maybe. I will measure them at some point when we're going to work on it. And in here we do have a two needles. That's the needles as our regular needles. They are sharp, kind of medium sharp. So there you have it. Nice. I'm really happy that they have metallic in here. Uh, the only one angel for now that I own doesn't have metallic threads and I do wait and I order one more angel so I would love to collect all all of them all four seasons plus uh, autumn I think I order winter that will come to me one day and now let's see canvas itself here she is and 14 count Ada. Did I mention size or not? I can't remember. 36 by 52 centimeters. The full canvas, you have to understand that. So the image itself, which will be a little bit smaller. Uh, printed nice, kind of like in a pastels colors. Uh, beautiful design, beautiful design. And printed very nice. You can see the symbols actually easy to recognize and separate from each other uh, let's see in here those swirls that we will be creating with the metallic threads i think i um spring which one i have do i have a spring or summer who remember <laughs> comment uh, because it is spring now it's you know it's march maybe i should start on one angel uh, but maybe after the, when I finish my uh, Ukrainian design that I work right now so very nicely if uh, in stitches if you want to know how much this how big it is it's 159 width and 240 high in stitches all symbols are, and stitches also printed on the side of the canvas uh, canvas nicely stitch around so it's not gonna fray. Joy Sunday always do this. Uh, I love about that. And usually this print after you wash coming out very, very beautiful. And you will have a beautiful, beautiful design created by you. So you can proudly display in your house. And I do recommend for you to have all four uh, uh, seasons um, not they don't have all four seasons plus noel in this store i believe but you can check some other stores as well and see um, this store i believe we from this store we review very very first one angel so definitely minimum two angels you can purchase uh, of of seasons from paint some way now let's see another canvas in here uh, yeah let's just do this one okay 
So this is one of those kind of like uh, some of the canvases lately I review in a circle. This one is Owl. Uh, oval. <laughs> Owl. I always say Owl. Oval. Um, I do have Oval uh, one of the hoops but I think my size is smaller so definitely you can go to Michael's store. Uh, also check tools section in the store and see if they have a size that would probably, no, probably not gonna fit because this is a big canvas actually. Uh, definitely you will need actual frame. Uh, you can see in here as display that it is, you can use um, frame, regular frame for this, but I do like when uh, people frame in an oval frame or have more kind of like a room from here to display like a coordinating some colors with this one which in here showing you a green one but to me it's maybe like a little bit too close to some to design you can have a little bit more matting done on the sides to pop this image more forward uh, but definitely you can frame them both way or oval or square or like rectangle in here so the design 37 by 48 centimeters, uh, 14 count Ada. And uh, sorry, let me just tell you, this one have no, yeah, Atom Angel, that, that's all it says in here. And in here it's called Garden 2, because the, since it says 2, it means we have a Garden 1 and maybe Garden 3, 4, I don't know. So check for that when you Google on a website. Uh, now the colors let's see this is just like a one flip page and that's it and all colors in here we have 37 colors in full stitch only that's it my friends only one type of stitching in here and that is full stitch and that's it now two needles beautiful looking colors in here yeah looks here it is, the colors of the threads and from this side, if I can show you this way, there, nice palette, there's a beautiful pink and purples, nice, very nice very nice very beautiful and here it is the oval i do have some oval frame but this is definitely a little bit bigger and as you can see that this the way it's designed obviously the part of the sky in here you don't have to stitch it is partial even if it's an oval but still partial because part of the canvas you don't have to stitch there's some uh, little bit here and there white color that you don't have to stitch like everywhere a little bit you see like uh, right there where you see white that's also partial that you don't have to stitch and big chunk of the sky and let's see do we have a confetti area no not bad not bad doesn't have a, like a bad confetti uh, printed very nice and bright you can see the col colors on the canvas that will be okay to find and separate uh, different symbols from each other. Okay, I also printed design in here. Uh, we do have some numbers in here that you don't even have to look in here. Just uh, recognize in here, for example, O2, all yellow colors, so you can go cross country and finish color by color through the whole thing so it is not much you can see in here on this pattern in here but there is lots of lots of flowers in here design is absolutely gorgeous garden i would love to take a walk up there and see some butterflies and bumblebees on those flowers and if you want to enhance your cross stitch you can add seed beads milk hill beads uh, to this design with some metallics or um, chronic uh, to make some more sparkles we are very often talking about this right now that you can incorporate with the beads because lots of you like beaded stitching but 
not too many this kind of designs yet that will come with the beads so we have to keep asking them and hopefully one day they will provide for us not just the charms and little tiny design with the bead stitching but actual canvases that we've been asking for three years now well i ask in the probably for three years on behalf from you okay one more uh my time will run out soon again i was hoping to get this in two sets <laughs> but i will have to probably restart my ca uh, camera one more time but i want this create in one video so we have one more canvas in here let's see there you go this canvas i were looking on this image for many years and decided if i like enough to order or not i do like this design but always kind of look on it and just walk away and order something nice but definitely uh, there's some uniqueness about this it's a old old mailbox that probably got abandoned and the flowers grow through already so obviously uh, i don't think you can get a mail there because the flowers grown unless it's still you can deliver some postage and diamond painting to put in that mailbox <laughs> you can see the beautiful bird uh, getting some nectar in from the flowers a uh, nice tree looks like it's going to be beautiful colors of dmc's up there to create all that shading and it looks like a bir birch birch uh, tree that i love and here is the flower oh look at that we have a web from the spider up there as well and butterfly hopefully not gonna get their wings in the spider um, trap lots of different flowers some wild daisies and obviously those pricks that are very very sharp stay away from those and looks like all the white piece in here will be partial that you don't have to stitch so the name of this canvas um morning glory and hum um human birds hummingbirds sorry i i always read in like a human hummingbirds uh yes beautiful and uh, my camera will stop in a second again but we will continue how many colors in here we have in here full stitch in 30 colors and back stitch in three six seven colors and that's it so full stitch and back stitch and the back stitch in here will be how much a lot a lot i have to say a lot if i can show you quickly a uh, little bit well for example here the spider web uh it's going to be out i can't really show you too close um the pattern you understand why but every flower every leaf is outlined in a back stitch but this is very very simple back stitch sometimes back stitch could be complicated and difficult to do this one is literally very very easy back stitch very simple you will have no problem and if you as i mentioned if you're not confident with the back stitch just watch a couple of my videos tutorials that will help you i hope so now the threads in here here's the gorgeous pink for the flowers the blues for the we have it here sky oh no now sky kind of look like a grayish but i like this tarnish uh, kind of rustic look so that that's the color is going to be this blues and brown for the mailbox itself and here okay uh so sorry if the video got a little bit longer that it's actually got longer than i expected to be honest okay some threads in here wow this is very nice and soft pastel colors like some canvas is so bright and boom like <laughs> speaking for themselves like look at this between this canvas and this canvas half difference on a color so this is very uh, i have to say very relaxing colors very 
pleasant because it doesn't look um, the canvas when it looks so bright like this yes it's nice to see colors but it's very busy for your eyes this one is softer so it's kind of i would say more more pleasant to your eyes to see and kind of like a more on a calm way relaxing way also you can see in here that there's uh, numbers on the canvas itself so it's very very easy to stitch big patches of colors very simple doesn't have much of um, doesn't have confetti at all super easy so i would say for beginners definitely definitely easy canvas to work for beginners uh, besides if you don't like backstitching so that's a little bit maybe advanced for you but as I mentioned very simple backstitching in here doesn't have those halfway like I don't know I think like it's going to be very easy to stitch and it's just a nice design nice spring or summer design what do you think spring or summer no probably summer already because all those green trees already have a leaves and we have their farm far away farmhouse the lucky people live to have a lot of land around them uh, I have to say thank you very much paint some way for this beautiful beautiful designs a beautiful product that you carry in your store and thank you everyone who stay with me today this unboxing definitely cheer me up because I like to see beautiful thing and it's distract me from what is going on and uh, thank you for your support as always and I will see you hopefully tomorrow you will have another video I will try my best to keep my channel live and non-stop working for the sake of my people to help them so I cannot abandon my channel I have to stay strong uh, not for myself but for my family and friends and all the people of Ukraine uh, glory glory to my country for them to fight like a tigers a year of the tiger uh, thank you for watching and I hope I will see you tomorrow